bowling units. Oh, right in the slots for Leeson to go big. What a catch! Brilliant <laughs> in her 100th game. That is incredible. One of the catches of the season so far. Oh, it goes up. Cries of catch it, but short fine leg won't get there and it will go away for a bonus boundary. Around the wicket to the left-hander comes Sammy Joe. And just straying down leg side. Fine leg up inside the circle and tucked away neatly. In the not too distant future, perhaps in the Ashes early next year. Right into the hitting zone of Eve Jones here. Well played, clears cover. He just got there though, that's the, the battle. To really hit the ball well enough and this one just clears mid wicket and that will race away with the top spin. Startled not to get the decision and that time right across her stumps. A little paddle around the corner for four. Yep, leading wicket taker, 14 in total, but picked off this time by Harmon Precourt. Jones tries to get some elevation and achieves that over backward square. At times for the Renegades, back up the top today. Oh, reverse sweep and got enough on it. Brilliant improvisation from Harmon Precourt and she'll get four for it. Jones straight down the ground. Thinks about running, but uh, doesn't need to. This game and the next two as well to be any hope. Harmon Precourt, hey. over the top she goes. The chase is on. Ball wins. A time of full toss. She ain't running Harmon Precourt because she hit it that well. It clears Phoebe Litchfield by about 10 metres for the first six of the ball game. For Hannah Darlington in terms of... Jones takes her on and goes long and really long. Bates bowling out here, and that's gone up. Bates may well have the breakthrough. Brilliant take, ta uh, catch taken by Corinne Hall here. And Duffin gets her away though. Only conceded one boundary so far. Susie Bates make it two. Couple of sixes to her tally two. First ball of the new over, Harmon Preet core. Oh, brilliant attempt. She's such a good outfielder. Litchfield did not give up on it. Down in Launceston against the Stars in game three this season for the Thunder. There's another full toss. And Harmon Precourt does not miss out. Placement the key. Threatened to back away. Stood there and whips it away for four more. Not being able to get it to dip enough. That time really digs it in and the improvisation again. Doesn't matter where you bowl to Harmon Precourt right now. They're going to the rope. So far in this over, so Harmon Precourt may well sweat on that. Does so, but still gets a top edge. Is there a fielder out there? No, there is not. Up inside the circle. Try and tighten the screws on the Renegades. Duffin straight back down the ground. Hit it sweet and all the way for her first six. Quality of these batters, I think they're just going to line you up if you give them a look at too many of the same deliveries time after time. Oh, jams it away for four more. Closing out her four-over spell. And a full toss to Harmon Precourt. And again, Duffin over the top. Beautifully timed. Oh, nearly took out Harmon Precourt, who was backing up a long way down to get back for two. So the throw's gone to the right end, and Duffin doesn't get back in time. Easy decision. Duffin sacrifices herself. Run out for 33 off the final ball of the inning. Callan herself starts with one outside off stump and Mundana able to find a way through and the chase is on off the first delivery and she'll start with a boundary. We just saw... Made room for the shot and found the gap. Drags it down. Mundana says thanks very much. On the way down. And beats mid off comfortably. They were both up inside. Dipped enough to bounce just slightly before Leeson. Oh, there was protection there. Got the bottom hand underneath it. Over and a half left in the power play. Drags that one around the corner. Work again for deep mid wicket. Holly outside off stump. A little edgy. And Duffin gets there to take a safe catch. A little bit more pace on the ball. Taken on. Pull shot is time. Cries of catch it. Gets that run rate required, back under 10 a little. And angles it through, a la Harmon Preet Kaur. There were cries of catch it. 
Again, the pull shot on offer in the gap. Four more. Fortunately, went for runs, 15 of them. Round O'Donnell gets the outside edge. Great catch. Wonderful hands from Haywood. Swung away by Wilson. Able to get it around Haywood. And no chance for... Easy pickings outside the off stump. Strays onto the leg stump this time. That's even easier. Get those twos. Go up in even numbers. And she'll go up in even numbers again here. Perfect placement. Backward of point. Every one of them on. Well struck here by Wilson. Test in the deep. Tried to scoop it back into play. And this time, the edge beats. Flicks it and clears the infield. There's two fielders there, so she has to get the elevation. Mundana swings. Fielder out there, but it's wide of deep cover. 100. She's giving it her best, but just can't find the rope at the moment. Maybe she does here and does and answers the critics. <laughs> Mundana makes room, gets the ball she's after. Outside off stump, Mundana expected that. Four, six, four, and it's game on again. It's fooling go this time. She's hit it sweet again, cries of catch it, off the keeper's hands. Tipped over for six. Tries to go big this time, gets hold of it, hits the fence on the full. And the biggest score ever by a Thunder batter in WBBL history. Such an expensive over now. Lifted over the top by Mundaner. And they'll get an easy two here to Falconer to keep the strike. That is a hundred of the highest quality from Smitty Mundaner. Off just 57 deliveries. Is it a match winning inning though? <laughs> There's still some work to do. What does Mundaner do? Advances. Strikes it well, beats the field. It'll be 13 required off the final over. Talia Wilson on strike. Mundana doesn't get hold of it again. Oh, fumble from Furling. Mundana should get back for two comfortably here. Suddenly it's eight off two, two boundaries to win it. Does she fire one in now? Outside off stop, times that one. Furling chases and it drops the catch. There's another two on offer. Back comes Mundana, who gets a life on 111, and look at the equation. Doesn't get hold of it. They have defended the total again, but only just the Renegades to go back top of the WBBL ladder. And the Thunder's hopes of playing finals this year are officially over. They gave it an incredible crack. That fall, four runs short.